Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, everybody. How are you, Luis? I'm so so, little tired. I have a lot of work today. Really? Yep. Good, good, good. Let's just wait for the others. When when are you finishing your job? Finishing. When is your last day of work? Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not sure uh, because uh, maybe we have to work the whole December. We only take a, a holidays to rest. So you're gonna be resting December 25th and the new year. January January 1st. Yep, but uh, this year it's gonna be on Saturday. See. Yeah, that is, is like a normal uh, week. Yeah. Yes, it is true. Saturday is 25th. And yeah, first. but January 1st is, is Saturday. My birthday is Monday. Oh my God, birthday is Monday. Really? Oh no, wait, wait. No, 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 my birthday is actually Thursday, January 27th. January 27th, oh my God. <laughs> That's bad. Okay, we are 10. What are the others? Okay, okay. You know what? Let me do the attendance while we wait for the others, okay? Okay. How? How? I got some videos for you tonight. Okay. And today is Wednesday and feels like Friday. Okay, Ada Susena Cáceres Mendoza. Present, good evening. Good evening, Andrés Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Carolina Yvette Romero Avelino. Erwin Lagos Andrade. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Heidi Eugenia Salguero de Rivas. Present. Irene Susana Cuella Albanés. Johnny Vladimir Portillo Chavez. Present teacher. Jose Antonio Cubillas Hernández. Present teacher. Thank you. Josué Alberto Salas Benítez. Sure. Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Luis Ernesto Romero Argueta. Present. Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde. Present. René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. Roberto Luis Sumaño Orellana. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. Present. Wendy Patricia Molina Duarte. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Suleima Ivón Moreno de Hernández. Present. Yes. Alexander de Jesús Sánchez Soto. And Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Okay. So the day before yesterday, we checked the present sample. Yesterday, we talked about the future. Okay. Let's make a question in past. Let's make a question in past. Let's get nostalgic, shall we? Okay. What? I don't think we should get nostalgic. <laughs> it's a good thing sometimes. 
Okay, so simple, but at the same time, very um, emotive, let's say. What did you use to love about your childhood and the Christmas season? What did you use to love about your childhood? Okay, let me tell you. You may laugh, you may laugh about this, but uh, I remember my childhood was really difficult because my parents got divorced, right? So they separate, they split, they split the four brothers, as I told you yesterday, right? So my brother and I uh, went with my, my grandma and she used to um, make us deliver bread in the morning before going to school at 5 a.m. We used to wake up at 5 a.m. and then go to, to the bakery. Um, to pick up some bread, you know, and in bags. I remember I was very small. I mean, I was like, I don't know, like eight, maybe eight or nine years old. And I used to carry these two bags, one on each side, or sometimes two bags on each side, you know, carrying the bread, then go back home, then just take one and go deliver the bread, come back home and just like that. Then I used to love the smell, the smell of the bread of the bakery, you know, hot bread. And then um, what I didn't like was to wear shorts with formal, formal shirt and um, a light blue, a light blue tie, a light blue tie with a gum, you know. It didn't used to be a real tie, it was like, Gum all the time. Can you imagine shorts, um, formal shirt, white? I mean, uh, but I used to love studying with um, orphans, with orphans because the place where I studied, there were there were nuns. You know what are nuns? Yeah, and there were kids without parents. You know, I used to study with them. I just love playing with them. Um, watching one of the nuns for Angela who used to play the guitar. And that's what I used to love. About Christmas, I used to love uh, starting, uh, getting, getting new clothes. It's like a tradition. I don't know if you have that tradition, but every Christmas you have to, you have to wear new clothes. So in my case, my mother used to send us some clothes or money to buy new clothes. It was amazing. I mean, the feeling, thinking that at night you were going to wear the clothes, even if you were not going anywhere, <laughs> you had to wear the new clothes. We used to go to church with my grandma. And what I really, really enjoyed on my childhood was singing. Every night after finishing um, the tortillas, you know, my, my grandma used to put us together. Uh, we used to gather, we used to gather around the, the cook where she used to do the tortillas, to make the tortillas. And she used to teach us how to sing. Uh, um, Pedro Infante, you know, music like that. She used to love singing and she, ta she taught my brother and me how to sing. That was amazing. It was an amazing childhood, I have to say. And that's me. How long did I talk? <laughs> Three minutes. Okay, it's your turn. Is this a good question? If not, go ahead, feel free. Feel free to make your own question in past. Okay, got it? Okay, remember, don't stop talking. Don't stop talking. That's the challenge right now. Let's go.
Yes. Okay. How are you guys? I'm fine. Are you? Fine too. Okay, perfect. Katie, you are so quiet today. What happens? I'm still thinking on so many things that I have to do. <laughs> but should I start? One, please first. <laughs> I, okay, I will start because ladies first, right? Okay, perfect. <laughs> okay. Um, what I liked most in my childhood is um, when we used to go on vacations after classes, I used to visit uh, to visit my my uncle's house, and we used to play with my cousins. What I liked the most it was that at home, I, my my stepmother used to make us go to bed at eight o'clock every single day, eight o'clock, not a minute later. And when I used to go to my uncle's house with my cousins, we used to play until eleven until 12 at night and I love that I love that because no. we were playing with their neighbors and it was so much fun and um, for Christmas and uh, we used to to go to my grandparents house and make this big party where the whole family in Santa Ana used to get together and I remember I, I told I told them yesterday I told someone this yesterday that uh, when I was a kid, you didn't drink too much soda. Like these days that you buy three liters, two liters, and you drink all the Coke you want. It didn't used to be like that. But I remember that my grandfather used to buy um, uh, uh, Cokes in bottles and gave us a whole bottle for each. And that made us so happy that you can't imagine. We all were waiting for our coke. <laughs> That's what I remember most. My husband and I um, make um, much activities. For example, uh, just no uh, the the past uh, past weekend. Uh, the the past Sunday, uh, we past, make a. Uh, you we, we can use past teacher or last. Okay. The last, the last weekend. Uh, okay. We make a. Um, I don't know how they say the Christmas tree. The tree. The tree? Yeah, tree, yes. And in the in here room, uh, we decorated the, the Christmas too. And he loved to uh, make a uh, Hebrew house too in the Ginger. Christmas Ginger season. House. Ginger. <laughs> Ginger. And Ginger <laughs> house. Or oh, really, not in Hebrew. In English, ginger is in Hebrew. Okay. In ginger house. And I don't know. Oh, I he love to uh, costume is different, right? Yeah, custom. Give me one minute. Yeah. Okay. He love custom to the. Uh, he and your your pets too in in the Christmas night. Ooh. Yes, your pet is a <laughs> how do you say reno? Uh, a deer, maybe no. Es el vecino del 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 reno. Render. Render. Reindeer. Yes. Maybe I'll be that. This year, maybe 
we can go out or go to the family. I didn't. I don't know. Oh my God, why are you only two? Okay, let me hear you. Okay. Um, Christmas in my children. I want the first sorry. Childhood. 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 I want the for the premiums, the gift for the fireworks and the chicken diner. Uh, saying the family and sharing with uh, them it was the best. Uh, maybe uh, dancing uh, with my sister and brother and family. Awesome. And do other. Wait, wait, Sandra, do you live, do you live in Mexicanos? Uh, yes. Do you in live in Los Alamos? Sacamil. In Los yes. Alamos? <laughs> really? Yes. <laughs> sí, en Los Alamos. How do I know? Ah? Uh? How do I know? ¿Cómo lo sé? Uh -huh. Because of the structure the structure of your house. Ah, really? Yeah, you live in Los Alamos. I, I, well, my parents bought a house uh -huh. in Los Alamos and uh -huh. I, I finished paying the house in 2008, I think, and I sold it. I sold it. I used to live in Pasaje Siete. Ah, I live in Pasaje Nine. Oh, oh really? Nine. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Yes. That's beautiful. Beautiful neighborhood. Yes. See, yeah. in front of the park. You live in front it's, of the park. Very yes. It's very uh, cool. Very cool. Uh, in the morning and the night. Oh my God! Mm -hmm. I miss that. I miss yes. It. it was beautiful. I love that neighborhood because you have very close the. Mercadito, right? Aha. Uh -huh. La Rosario. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Sí, yes. Okay. Yeah, awesome. Bring me some memories. Okay. Why I... the memory perfect, teacher? <laughs> Adita. Hello, teacher. Uh, what I remember was I love the 18 bread with the chicken juice and eat ice cream. Visit my grandparents for gifts and money and going to the mass and putting in the uh, new clothes and shoe and visit my family early because your of neighbors. Your... <laughs> uh, neighbors. Because of the fear of the um miedo a los juegos eso artificiales a la pólvora. You used to fear the fireworks? Yes. Oh. It's a uh, uh, dangerous. <laughs> it was dangerous. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay. Very good, guys. Great job. Let's yeah. take. Okay. Let's take it back. You're two alone. Let me take you with another group, okay? So you're not just the two of you. Let's go to another group. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're done? 
Yes. Oh. Uh, uh, okay. Let's take it back. Okay. Oh my God, I just realized. You see what's on my back? What does it say? <laughs> that is so wrong. Hmm. I didn't want to see it. Anyhow, I'll correct that later. We're not an intermediate too. Uh-oh. <laughs> this is intermediate four. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Let me choose Miguel tonight. And Miguel, select someone else. Let me see. <laughs> Luis Ernesto Romero. Me parece que. Okay, perfect. Now help me with something, guys. What WH words do you remember? What WH words do you remember? Come on. Where, when, where, what, why, what, why, who, who, who. Who with? Ari, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, Come on, guys. Everybody. Which? 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 What? What? Huh? what? Oh, no, 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 no. No, what is right there? <clears throat> Where, when, you're missing one. How? 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 Mm. Very good. What about whose? Mm. Yeah. That's it, right? Yep. Okay. Now, I want you to help your, your customers. I want you to help your, <laughs> your classmates, okay? Help your classmates. How? Well, pay attention to your classmates and make questions. For example, if Miguel says, man, I used to live in a very small town. Where did you live? Again, Katie? Where, where did you used to live? Where did you where used did to, you live? to live? Okay, let's get more information from Miguel Angel, okay? Let's get more information from Liz Ernesto. Ready, Miguel? Okay, so the question goes for you, Miguel. What did you used to love about your childhood and the Christmas season? Go. This is for me. Okay. Well, I love, I love going with my father to buy my new clothes. <laughs> yes. Uh, well, at, at that time, I didn't, I didn't give it so much importance, but now that my father is not here, I would like to return time, but it's difficult. My father died in uh, 2013, yeah. And well, I think another thing I miss is meeting at the house, meeting, I'm sorry, meeting at the house with all my friends. Yeah, yes. We used to go. We used to go to eat to eat at each friend's house, each friend's house. Yeah, and then we, and then we. I don't know. Reventar pólvora, <laughs> and then we burn fireworks. Yeah, and this. Yeah, and this. I remember. <laughs> See that. Yeah. 
Thank you. I didn't hear anybody making questions. What's ha what happened? There is a question in the chat. I, I made it, but I didn't hear anybody stopping <laughs> stopping Miguel and saying, hey, what did you used to eat? What uh -huh. was your favorite meal for Christmas? Mm -hmm. Come on, make questions to Miguel. Yes, what did you use to eat? Oh, well, I, I ate uh, chicken and fruit, a lot of fruit. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Chicken and tamales. I don't know. But... <laughs> tamales. Tamales. Yeah. I ate a lot of tamales. I love tamales biscuits. Tamales biscuits. <laughs> okay. More questions. Oh my God. There are so many questions you can make. And uh, what kind of fireworks did you use to burst? To burst. Wow. What kind of fireworks? Well, I, I like, I, I remember that my favorite is uh, Silvadores in English. Was, was Silvadores? <laughs> yes. Yeah. Whistlers. 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 Whistler. Yeah, Silvadores was my favorite. <laughs> yeah. Fernando? <coughs> Assistant? Uh, that was the, the same question. <laughs> hey, this said. I have a, a funny question for you, Miguel. Did you have a crush as a child? Did you have a crush? Uh, maybe a cousin? A cousin? What's <laughs> your crush? <laughs> As a child. I don't know. Someone, Not really. <laughs> a crush, a crush. Someone that you wanted to dance with. You couldn't dance. You couldn't dance as a child, but you were like, oh, I have to dance with her tonight. I have to dance with her. Not really, but I remember that I I like the girls. <laughs> yeah, of course. Yeah. And I had not uh, a girlfriend. <laughs> and you didn't have you didn't have a girlfriend. Also, great job, Miguel. Hey, let's correct some vocabulary here. Um, yeah, just say burst fireworks, guys. Burst fireworks. Miguel, repeat, close. Close. No. The, same, the same thing. It's not cloths or clothes, but it's close. 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 Yeah, repeat, close. think. Just think. like close, cerrar. Yeah, just like cerrar, right? Mm -hmm. Like close. I thought it was different. Yeah, many teachers say it's cloth or mm -hmm. I mean cloth is trapo. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but and close close doesn't have a plural. Oh wait, it doesn't have a singular. Sorry. It doesn't have a singular. Many many teachers teach cloth. Cloth. And they put a they make a lot of effort, you know, to say cloth. But Americans don't say cloth, they say clothes. Clothes. Nice clothes. Okay. The outfit. So many people in El Salvador are saying, oh, I like your outfit. Me gusta tu outfit, boy. Okay. And yes, you say burst fireworks. Okay. Let's go with um, Luis Ernesto. Please make questions. Stop him. Stop him. Okay. And say, what did you used to eat? Uh, how old? How old were you? So many questions you can. Make. Did you used to dance? Okay, go. The same question. Yeah, same okay. question. Okay, guys. In my childhood, I used to love vacations. When I am for the school, and I uh, have a vacation from November to January, um, I used to like to uh, watch the, the cartoons at the morning, the, almost the whole morning. And then in the noons, um, to go out 
and played uh, soccer or something with my friends to think about what we are going to do when we was uh, when we comes a uh, adult. Um, uh, for the Christmas season, I used to love my uh, mother's food, the taste my mother uh, make uh, with the um, chicken. I used to eat chicken at the dinner and the sauce my mother uh, do is the, the best. And another thing I used to love is to stay awake until 12, the midnight, and burst the fibers uh, to stay with the family um, and go to the bed uh, until late. And the next day, um, um, I used to love to go out and look for the, the fibers I, I didn't burst. <laughs> um, what else? I think it's the, the most I, I love. What kind of cartoons do you do you used to watch? I remember I I watch I the snorkels I think it the, the same at the English than Spanish. Uh, he man when I was a uh, almost a major I liked Saint Seiya. Um, uh, is is my favorite I I. By the way, I saw again with my daughter, and she really likes that that cartoon. Um, Which cartoon you said? Saint Seiya, Los Caballeros del Zodiaco. Oh yeah, Spanish. Mm -hmm. Seiya, Seiya, yeah. Uh, Saint Seiya, yes. That's the name. Yes, I really love that. Um, and just that, Silverhawk was another, and Thundercat. You know, I always, <laughs> I always wonder. That's a, that's a great topic, but we, we're going to talk about that in a minute. But okay, more questions, more questions for Luis. What did your mother used to cook? Chicken. Chicken. Sometimes tamales, but. Most of the time, chicken in sauce and uh, um, bread with chicken. I, I, don't, I don't know if the same teacher uh, to prepare the bread with chicken and vegetables. And the classic, um, I, have, I forgot the name, was um, the, the, the classic, um, La Cerda se me fue el nombre. The, the classic. Ah, berro. Yeah, berro, berro. Berro. The, the, the classic bear, yes. How do you say bear? <laughs> with the sauce. I love bear. I, I love it. Yeah, it's delicious. Yes. But, but just, like just in this bread. Yeah, just in that bread, I, 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 I think. And the next day, to recalentado for it. <laughs> it's the best recalentado. The yeah. whole week. Yeah, the whole week. <laughs> the whole season. That's like vacations for mothers. No. <laughs> no. I would love to cook. Yeah, that's like vacation for mothers. And it's our time to try it, right? Yeah. Yeah. This is so funny. Um, okay. You see, it, we adapt everything. Snorkels. In English, it was snorks, snorks. Mm -hmm. In Latin America, it was snorkels, snorkels. That was so funny. I can I cannot remember the characters, but I remember the the, the watching this this cartoons that was yeah. amazing. The Thundercats. Oh my god! I used to run. I used to uh, collect. The album, you remember the album of the, the yep. Thundercats? I had it, yes. and, I, and we fill it up with my brothers. I remember that. Okay, let's see. Huh? When we were 
you corrected yourself very good very good you corrected yourself when we were not when we was the taste of my mother now i'm gonna stop you here did you ever try your mother yeah <laughs> actually actually we we all we all tasted our mother when we we were cruel as a, as babies as babies we were cruel oh my god okay so the taste of my mother's food the taste of my mother's some people say my mother's cook i miss my mother's cook okay extraño la cocina de mi mamá Okay, the way she, she used to cook. Until 12 the night. Until 12 the midnight. Until 12 midnight. Not the. Look for the fireworks that didn't burst. I used to look for the fireworks that didn't burst. Who did that? Who else did that? Go around looking for the fireworks. Everybody. Everybody used to do that, right? Okay, let's finish this conversation. I love to do this with you guys. I wonder one thing. We kids, I mean, we guys, boys, we used to watch Transformers, Silverhawks, uh, Thundercats, Snorkels, even- Heathcliff. Heathcliff, yes. Garfield, but girls, Girls, what did you used to watch when you were kids? Gem and the holograms. What? <laughs> Gem and the holograms. Voltron. Really? Voltron? I don't, I don't Godzilla. Katie, okay, you got Ultraman. me lost. You got me lost. Ultraman. Sulema, really? Yeah. Spiderman. That was for boys. Rude girl. My sister saw uh, Sailor Moon. Sailor Moon. Heidi. Heidi. Candy. 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 Candy was too. Peline. She used to have yeah, too many Peline. boyfriends. I remember Peline. Peline. Jose Miel. <laughs> Jose Miel. Oh my God. Jose Miel. And Pica Piedras. Yeah. The Flintstones. Flintstones. Oh my God. Man. The. That is correct. Say Smurf. Pupitufos. Snurfs, that's the name, that's the English name, mm. Snurfs. Yeah, what was the name Shira. of the family, the family from the future? Mm. Durama. Durama. Supersonicos. Mm -mm. Ah, yes, Supersonics. Durama. Yeah, the Flintstones. <laughs> at, at, mid, at noon, they used to play the Flintstones at noon. Teletubbies, nah, really? No. Yeah. Nah, no, no. <laughs> Teletubbies is new. Do it again, do it again. Teletubbies is my song. Power Rangers. No. Yeah. Wait, Goku. Really? Power Goku. Rangers. Yeah. Of course. Then, then, then we, we evolved. We evolved yeah. with Goku. Oh my God. Yeah. Good times. Good times. Now, I was thinking that this afternoon, you know, my kids are, haven't got the feeling of being raised by cartoons. Because in the end, they transmitted a message to us, you know, a lot of messages. Jose Miel, come on. He was always in the struggle, you know, struggling for her, for his mother. Yeah. A lot of trouble. Okay. The bad luck guy. Yeah. It was funny. Okay. So great to have you. Oh, and you know what I used to love? I really, really used to love. Let's see. The Metro Golden Mayor cartoon. Oh yeah. Man, sometimes they there was no dialogue. There was no dialogue, but that those were great, great cartoons. great cartoons. Okay. Okay, let's go back to our adulthood. Hey, how are you doing with your molars, by the way? Better? Yeah, I feel so good. Feel better now? Yeah. 
I have a lot of pain relief without that two molars. <laughs> oh my God, good. Can you eat? Uh, but soup, uh, fruit, vegetables, and uh, something like that. Not solid yet. Mm -mm. No, okay. not yet. Hey, you look thinner. Yeah. You look thinner. That, that's good for a woman, right? It's like, woo. Yeah. It's not, um, uh, I'm not so happy about that, but I'm okay. Yeah. Come on. Look at the positive side. Okay. We're 19. Let's, let's start with our topic on your book. Yeah, I'm going to do it. Yes. I'm sorry. Let's move on. So, Tonight, oh, let's finish what we started yesterday. Where was it? I'm sorry. I almost placed it. Teacher. Hey. Sorry, can I make a question? Yes, please. Uh, yesterday I tried to, to finish the exercise that, I, that it was with mistake in the platform, but mm -hmm. apparently it hasn't been repaired yet. Oh, the, the I got your point. Hold on. See. 1.7. 1.7, right? Yeah, same question. 2.2. Um, I done everything, but in the in the score up here, 18. 18. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 18, 20. Mm -hmm. and, okay. and all of the answers are correct. Okay, so we're on 1.7. The shipment will be delivered as soon as the payment is received. Mm -hmm. Yep. Report it again. Hang out in just a minute. Intermediate. Okay, there you go. I reported it again. Let's move on. Uh, don't worry, they will fix it eventually or just give it as a valid answer for all of you. That's okay. Fernando is going to fix it. By when? What? <laughs> oh, for that, for that note, yeah, can you hack the website and just fix the note, the scores for everybody, please? Yeah, ready. <laughs> can I can? You got it. You got it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm on it. I'm on it. Hey, yeah. <laughs> no, don't do it. Don't do it, for them, please. I can't. Okay. So, <laughs> yesterday we talked about the definitions of each one of those. So, what is the right product? Do you remember? Do you define each one? Are you still lost with this? They are right product. Yeah, what is the right product? Do you remember? Did you finish this as group? Yeah, but it's no, it's not right. <laughs> Yeah, we're all correct. confused. We're, we're confused. Right? Yeah. Yeah, we were a little bit lost. We were a little bit lost. Oh, what was what? Hold on. We can do it again. We should. We should actually, because we need to understand this uh, concepts. Just a minute. Level four. Oh, no, I the old book. Okay, let's do something. Let's just discuss this for three minutes, five minutes in a very small group so we can all get the hen of it. Oh, let's get the hen of it. Do you understand that phrase? No. No. Really? Alexander, do you have never applied that phrase? Doesn't ring the bell. No, uh -huh. oh, it's like, 
It doesn't ring any bell. It doesn't ring any bell. Okay. Doesn't ring. Get the hand of it. Agarrenle la onda. Literal. Literal. Don't worry. You will get the hand of it. You will get the hand of it. How do you write? How, how do you the, write it? it? It's on the chat. It's on, on the, the uh, Zoom chat. Okay. Zoom chat. Ah, okay. You'll get the hand of it very soon. A new employee comes, you train him, and he goes like, no, I'm sorry, I'm not understanding anything about this. Okay, don't worry. You'll Chill get out. The hand of it. Chill out. <laughs> you're going to have, you, you're going to get the hand of it. You're going to get the hand of it. Okay, I'm just trying to look for the answers for you so we can do it together. Uh, but let's think about the possible answers one more time and then we come back and share it with everybody, okay? Really quick, just five minutes. And let's put this together. Let's go. I left him this this photograph. I'm going to go. I'm going to share and yours did you do that? Team guys. Hi. Did you do the the exercise last time, last class? We make it, uh, but I don't write. <laughs> but we can compare. I remember uh, only with the fur we have a uh, we have uh, confused. Because confused, we, confused. Yeah. yeah, and the number one, I don't know it was a um, right condition. Um, the right time. Um, um, okay. And for example, in my in my opinion, the number one is right customer. No, right no, no, no. Number two, number two. Right place. Number two is right place. Dell must have strict yes. control and process to ensure that products ordered on their website are delivered delivery to the right location. Right place. What right do place. you think? Like customer, you say? The number one. For me, it's number one, right customer. Um, uh, I have number six, right customer. <laughs> White postman. Number number two. No. Right no. place. Number two, right place. Uh -huh. right, right place. Number three. Yes. Right quantity. Right quantity. Right. Mm -hmm. right Grocer quantity. has to meet quantity requirement. For the number quantity. four. Uh, right condition. Uh, 
And number five is right price. Yes, yes, I agree with you. Okay. Number six is right product. Um, I have numbers number seven, right condition. Right condition. Seven, right yes. condition. It is uh, number four, right number condition. Four. Mm. Okay. Okay, captured manufacturer. What do you think, uh, Johnny, in the mm, number mm. seven? Number seven, I have see. And right, right price, number four. Sorry, number seven, seven. Yes, seven. In seven, I have. Mm. Is right time. Right, right time. time, yeah, because right uh, time. Uh, to ensure right time, delivery to customer, right mm -hmm. time. And uh, number one, what is? Like customer, no. Uh-huh, like customer. Mm -hmm. Amazon must ensure product are Amazon. delivered within today. If the customer can get it with in today from some other company. Company. Mm. Are they even it's it's a little confused. The it is. From some other companies. Uh. Amazon must sure product are delivered within today. When is today. the customer can get it within today, today from some other company. Amazon some must other ensure, company. Amazon must sure products are delivered with today. Hello, teacher. Hello, Caroline. You're done? We yeah, think so. More. We're not sure, but no, we think uh -huh. so. Okay. Okay, let's go back so we can study this case. I'm just doing this to see who responds. <laughs> okay, nobody's responding. Let's just wait for your classmates. Hello, Caroline. Are you sick? Hello, hello, teacher. You sick, right? A little bit. Oh, a cold? Something like that. <laughs> a phonic. You're a phonic? Oh my God, don't listen to your voice. I'm sorry to hear that, but thank you. Thank you for being here. It's really good. Okay, we're all back. So let's kick it. Let's kick it. Who remembers that? Eyes, eyes, baby, to go, to go. Eyes, eyes, baby, to go. 
Okay, that's another topic, mini vanilli. Mm -hmm. Okay, so number one, what do you have under number one? Right place. Right place, who says? You know what, let's do something, grab a tool, grab a tool, please. Okay, grab a sticker on your tools and just put it on one of the seven R's that you consider is number one. Some said right product. Miguel says right place. Right time. Right time. Yes. Alexander says right product, Fernando the right place, Jose Antonio the right product. Hmm. Hmm. Is this changing his mind? No, it's the same. Okay, guys. Okay, as per the book, okay, this is the right condition. the right condition. Okay, that's as per the book. Let's analyze why. Amazon must ensure products are delivered within two days. If the customer can get it within two days from some other company. The right condition, why are they saying that that's number one? The right condition. Hmm. The product should be on the right condition. Now, what are the seven R's referring to? We're talking about logistics management. Logistics management. So the product must arrive on the right condition. Right place. Yeah, I mean, I'm just, I'm just giving you the right answer as per the book, okay? The book states that number one is right condition. Products are delivered within two days if the customer can get it within two days from some other company. So what Amazon do, do is they go and look for the closest, the closest uh, vendor, the closest vendor who has the item available to make the delivery faster. Tonight, we're going to learn about the distribution channel of Amazon. It's crazy, you won't believe it. Okay, what's number two? Yeah, right place. <laughs> right place, who says right place? Go check, put a check mark. Right place? Right place. Okay. Everybody's going for place here. Okay, right place. Yeah, I'll go for that as well. Okay. What about number three? Quantity. 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 That is correct, quantity. Okay, quantity grocers have, grocers has to meet quantity requirements for their customers and ensure that the quantity of the products is not affected by perishability. It's not affected by perishability. Can anybody infer how the quantity of a product can infer, can damage a perishable item? No, okay. If you stack, if you stack too many products, maybe, right? What's number four? Number four? Customer. Alexander says it's customer, and yes, it is customer. customer. A local ketchup manufacturer may sell ketchup 
to retailers in packaged and labeled bottles and to a bulk, bulk consumer in big cans. So the package differs between um, retailers and final consumers. The package varies, it's different. What's number five? Price? What price? Price. Yes, guys, that's right, Lila, yeah. The right price, why? Samsung must ensure that their mobiles are charged with the corresponding prices to the retailer stores and customers. This is what I was telling you about. One of the things that they make sure of is that you get the right price. No matter who is selling a Samsung phone, you have to get the right price. If they, um, if they distribute their product to uh, this person, you, they got to give you the right price. Okay, number six. Right, product. Product. I agree with you. Product. That's right. Product. Why products that the cons the customer needs either today or in the future? Smartphone, laptops, TVs. The right product to cover their needs, and finally, time. Time. Pido time, pido time. Time, that's right. Um, Who has to, has to warranty that sufficient amounts of products are available in the warehouse to ensure right time delivery to customers? Okay, very interesting how this works. What is still confusing is number one, right? Number one, why the right condition? Remember, we're talking about um, delivering the product. We're talking about logistics. So to have a successful logistic process, to have a successful logistic process, logistics uh, companies, they take care of all of these in that order. Number one, the condition of the product must be uh, the proper, the promised one. In other words, you have to get what you order. You have to get what you order. And to ensure that you get what you order in good conditions, for example, Amazon uses uh, local, local distributors, local retailers, and they buy the product from them just to sell it to you. The right place, ensure the products order on their website are delivered to the right locations, the right place. This is like a general, a general obligation of every company. They always check the, the address before they deliver anything. Quantity. The quantity of the product is not affected by perishability. I'm so <sighs> thoughtful about it. But yeah, that has to do a lot. Please read the again, make sure you understand it. I think this is part of your exams, part of your exercises, right? Oh. Mm. What? what? Okay, I think this is part of your exercises on the platform. I'm just gonna send you the screenshot so you can have it handy. Let me do the attendance one more time before we jump into the next topic. We're gonna watch a movie in the class, okay? Woohoo! Oh my God, no, we're not gonna watch the movie, okay? Uh, so, let's see. Ana Susana Cáceres Mendoza. You're playing with our feelings, teacher. I cannot do that, I'm sorry. Andrés Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Present, teacher. Awesome. Carolina Ivette Romero Avelino. Present. Irwin Lagos Andrade. Present, teacher. Thank you. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Heidi Eugenia Salguero de Rivas. Present. Irene Susana Cuellar Albanés. Present. Johnny Vladimir Portillo Chávez. Present. 
José Antonio Cubías Hernández. Present. José Alberto Salas Benítez. Present. Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura. Luis Ernesto Romero Argueta. Um. Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde. Present. Miguel, are you staying tonight with me 10 minutes? Yes, teacher. Excellent. René Alfonso Madrid Escalante. There. Roberto Luis Umaño Orellana. Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. Wendy Patricia Molina Duarte. Present, teacher. Thank you. William Alexander Ramirez Flores. Present. Suleyma Ivonne Moreno de Hernández. Present. Thank you. Alexander de Jesús Sánchez Soto. Present. And Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present. Thank you. Okay. Let me do something really quick here before I play the movie. Come on. <laughs> Not funny. Yes, it's funny. Hold on. No, well, it's not that funny, but yeah, you, you gotta find some. <laughs> Don't cheat on us. This. Don't cheat us. Don't play with us. Don't cheat us. <laughs> I'm not cheating on you. We are not married. Give me just a minute. Yeah, how are you guys? I'm sorry. I'm just looking for you. Hold on. Oh, oh. In this case, sería, yeah, it would be <laughs> trick us. Yeah, it's no. trick us. Yeah, and trick us. Don't worry, I'm not going to do that. Oh my God. G eleven C dash I four. Excuse me, I'm just trying to find one of our previous classes just to project um, that over here. So I'm gonna have to go to our chat, go to our group, share the links. Okay. Okay, so I just want to show you something for those of you who may not know how to wear this. So, there we go. Okay, here. So this is one of the previous videos. Okay. You know how you can go here to the subtitles. Okay, and you can just activate the subtitles. If you have yeah, the people, how are you? English, they will show up in English, right? Some of you may not know about this. Okay, and there we're, we're talking. Number one, number two, you go to configuration. Okay, you can go to so uh, to speed. Okay, you can go to speed and put it on 0.75%, for example. Then you what will- is the most there. important value a company should get for distribution services? Okay. What is the most important value? You see, got it? Why, yes, am, why am I telling you this? Because the first video you're gonna watch, I need you to gather new vocabulary, just pay attention to the new vocabulary in context with our class. Let me share the first video with you. The first video is very short, it's just three minutes, but we cannot, remember, we cannot display it. In fact, let me stop this. Okay. So it's on your WhatsApp, the first video is on your WhatsApp, it's just three minutes, let's start watching that video. 
There you go. I just send you the link to WhatsApp. I'll give you five minutes to watch, take notes on your notebook. I'll be here. I'll be right back. Just going to make sure the door is closed. One minute. Okay, how did it go?
Let me know whenever you're ready. I'm just waiting for you. Let me know whenever you're ready so we can start. And in fact, if you've finished, you can start sharing the new vocabulary on the chat, on the Zoom chat. Okay, let's see. Hmm. Open road. Key picks. One super road. I would say one super road. Be left. Key picks doesn't sound like a word. Mm, capital expenditure. Capital expenditure. That's not the capital, okay? Com, com score, com score. Mm, that's not a word. Yeah, that's not, that's just a name. That's a name, Suleyma, com score. Sorting, sorting is like, um, Mixing, you know, selecting, selecting from a numerous things, sorting, Alexander. Andres, vantage point, who has the advantage? Stowed, stowed is like uh, the envelope, like packaging, it's a synonym of uh, packaging. To keep, to save something. Wrapped up, wrapped is what you do with the gifts, with the presents for your family. You wrap them. And there's a beautiful song from Sting called Wrapped Around Your Finger. Wrapped Around Your Finger. Okay. Fulfillment, uh, to fulfill an order, to fulfill an order. I don't know how to explain this. For example, this coffee cup is fulfilled to the middle. It's the middle of the coffee cup. Mm -hmm. Mailed. That letter must be mailed, Johnny. That letter must be mailed to send through mail. Sustainability. Can somebody define sustainability? <clears throat> Do you remember feasibility? 
Is it sustainable to continue selling this product? Sustainability in time? Is your, is your life sustainable right now? The way you live, I mean, for example, if you live in Escalon and you lose your job, is it sustainable to continue living in, in Escalon or, yeah? Sostenible? Yeah. yeah. Beautiful Spanish. Yes. Forward. Forward to the front. Moving ahead. Moving ahead to the front. Again, wrapped up, we said to involve, put something around something, you know, a wrap. Don't you like the wraps from McDonald's? McDonald's wraps, okay. Oh, no, you don't like it, okay. This thing a burrito. It's like, yeah, it's like a burrito, exactly. Very similar, so you wrap the food inside a cylinder, you wrap it, you wrap it. The same with a present for your mother, you wrap it with paper and a chonga. How do you say chonga, a uh, ribbon? It's a ribbon. Okay, that's it? Okay, what is the video about? The shopping about... was made on Cyber, Cyber Monday on 2012. 2012. Was that 2012? 2020. 2020. 2020, right? Hmm. 2020. What do you think about that company? They are efficient. Fantastic teacher. Only that. <laughs> Fantastic. Yeah. Now, do you think Amazon makes a lot of revenue? Yes. Out of yes. wait, wait, out of each product. The, the guy who was explaining mentioned that they have 80 distribution centers. I don't, I don't know. Yes, I, I listen wrong, but I listen that, that they have 80 distribution yeah. centers. You did, it is right. And they process millions of orders every single day. Billions. Billions. And now for Christmas, for Thanksgiving, Cyber Friday, was it? My God, it's crazy. The share the link was the, your, your sent to WhatsApp. That is the, the video. Yeah. But the date of Uplab, the video is November 26 on 2012. Okay. So yeah, most likely it was 2012. I don't know, I haven't watched the video. I just wanted you to tell me. I kind of understood what the video was about, but I want you to tell me. Okay. So regarding, regarding the... Uh, the topic, the distribution channels. Does, is Amazon its own distributor? Does he distribute the product by himself? Um, he has they have 80 retailers. No, no, actually by retailers. No, but Jocelyn just said it. They have 80. Yeah. Distribution channel or sender. Four are in Phoenix, and the other ones are, are all over, all over yeah. the United States. Wow. Okay, and they don't produce. Okay, so what's the key? How do they make money? By logistician. By logistics? Yeah. Through, I'm sorry, through logistics. Through logistics. Okay, Wendy, Jocelyn, William, Carolina, Haiti, Miguel, Sandra, Alexander, Irene. Please try to turn on your camera. Thank you. Sorry. Okay. I feel I'm Just having dinner. It's okay. It's okay. 
Okay, so how do they make money? I mean, if they don't produce the product, what is Amazon's main source of income? I repeat, what is Amazon's main source of income? But they have uh, our own brands, teacher. They have their own brands. Yes, they have Fire TV, Amazon Video, True. Amazon Music, the Kindle app. Can uh -huh, to read ebooks. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. But what gives them the most money? No idea? Okay, let's get to understand that by watching another video. <laughs> this one is six minutes again take notes if you don't understand a word pause the video take notes of the whole sentence okay take notes of the whole sentence so you can repeat it in the class got it okay. got it okay pay attention Pay attention to this. This, this video is going to help you if you are an entrepreneur, if you have your own small business and you're selling eggs, for example, in your house or cheese, you know, okay, pay attention because this is going to help you a lot. Okay, go ahead. Job descriptions made simple.
sorry I thought my camera was on. I'm just waiting for you. Let me know. Whenever you're ready. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Let's go again with the vocabulary. It's a lot of vocabulary mm. in this video. Mm. Leverage. That's like elaborate. Leverage. Mm, okay. It's, very, it's a synonym. Goodwill. By faith. Goodwill is something by faith. Willingness. Leverage is like uh, to take advantage, actually. Take advantage of something to elaborate how are you going to take advantage of that. Okay. And yes, goodwill is like having the willingness of doing something. Revenue, we saw that that's like um, the money that you make, the real money that you make out of a sale. One thing is the money that you earn. And the other thing is the revenue. You can earn $10, but you have to pay taxes out of this $10. So the difference is your revenue. So then. Okay, it's waiting for you. There's a lot of vocabulary. Let's see, goodwill, revenue, Kindle. The Kindle is a brand from Amazon. There was some sort of tablet, you know, they produced a tablet for you to read books, digital books, and you can buy the books on, on, on Amazon. You can download the app. Nowadays, it's an app, it's not longer, well, you can still buy the Kindle and it's very cheap, you know, and then download the books. There's a lot of free books, but there are books that you have to pay for. 
tangible, tangible, something that you can touch, Jocelyn. Untangible, okay. untangible, the opposite. Real estate, Lima, real estate is like, for example, uh, selling houses, selling land, right? That's real estate. You can be a real estate agent and sell houses or resell houses, making money. Come on, guys, there, this was a longer video. There was a lot of words. That's it? Really? That's it? Yeah. Okay. I think some of you are still watching the video. Failure. The opposite of success. Failure. Come on, you can type it for everybody. Failure. That's the opposite of success. Okay, can somebody tell me what was the video about? Actually, it's so interesting because this actually opens my, my eyes, right? You know, because it's not about the product, it's about the your distribution channel, right? Because it, it's no to get money first, it's more create a confidence or trust to your customer, right? Create a, a good environment in order to get customer through your customers. Actually, I, I understood that because they create a, a strategy using emails. And when you have your list, you have to to follow two rules. I don't remember exactly the rule, but it's like uh, the first rule is about that you need to tell about product that you um, try or prove before, not product that you don't use it before. So you can promote products that you have used but you cannot promote products that you have never used. Yeah. Got it. Yeah, this is about distribution channel. This is. Have you seen any, I, you, that... any YouTuber promoting products? Yeah. Okay. Have you seen people criticizing them? Like, oh my God, I can't believe you are promoting that product that doesn't work. You haven't tried it, haters. Yeah. In every channel on YouTube. Every channel on YouTube, right? Guys, yeah, so this is something that I want to recommend to you. They are not paying me for promoting this product. Mm -hmm. Now you know, they get paid for promoting products. You can get paid for promoting products. I, I like the idea of selling B, you know, when you don't think about your product and you actually think about um, about the distribution, how are you going to distribute this, this product? That's very interesting. Now, something that, can you tell me something that blows your mind? Something that blew your mind, I'm sorry. What was something that blew your mind? Uh, the, the video uh, uh, was was all right because when we create a product or want to to earn money, uh, usually we we think that the, the, the best way to to earn to get money is selling the product or create something to sell. Mm -hmm. But maybe this focus on create a, a, how do you say, dependency from customers. No, 
using your product nor selling your product. So maybe it's like a, uh, I, I create a product and I don't, I don't want to sell the product. I, I, I want to, to get customer to consume my product like a service. True. True. And they become promoters, supporters, promoters of your product. Okay. Yes, is, if your customer are, are satisfied with your service, they, how do you say, correct la voz? It is mouth to mouth publicity. Um, they recommend you in recommend you. digital channels. Yeah. They spread the voice. Fernando, that's the way you say it. They spread the voice. True. And nowadays with social networks, it's so easy for you to get free publicity. Now, something that blew my mind, but let me wait. I just want to hear what some of you, um, what blew your mind? What, what made you go like, oh my God, what was it? Please, Katie. Johnny, welcome back. Good morning. <laughs> Wake up, Johnny, we're almost done. Uh-huh. So what blew your mind, Luis? Did you see the big amount? How much money can she make? I think is uh, the thing that blew my mind is you have to change. First, you have to change your mind. It's nothing is you, you are going to sell a product. You have to make, uh, uh, for example, make first the distribution channel because it's going to ensure yourselves. It's going to assure. Assure, yeah. Assure your, yourselves. Your, your, one, one, one important thing I, I saw in the video is about the, you first made your loyalty audience for your products and they'll engage with them and give your product. Give them your product for free sometimes. Yep. Yeah, that was a very good example. I What blew my mind was a number. I saw a number, $100,000 a year. I think it was a year. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, I mean, that's a lot of money. And the thing is that technology has opened the markets. I mean, you can sell things to Europe nowadays, to Africa. I mean, as easy as that. It is amazing. Services, even services through virtual video conferences, you know. Okay. So that was good, right? Watch the video again, learn to do that. I mean, if you are an entrepreneur, that's a great idea. Okay. So the next topic we have is to match more vocabulary. This, this unit is fulfilled of vocabulary. Now, I need you to think of your own experience as a customer. You need to choose three of the seven hours and discuss why they are relevant to ensure positive experience for the customer. So let's choose three of the seven R's that we have been discussing. Product, place, because customer, quantity, condition, time, or price. And let's get a, a quick example before we get, well, we don't have enough time to get split it. So let's do it together. Let's create a discussion, but I need you to speak, okay? What is more important out of the three arts? Let's define together in our own words, out of seven, what are the most, the three most important things when you buy a product, let's say in Amazon. Mm -hmm. I'm all ears, I'm all ears. Yeah. 
83 years old. Come on, guys. Okay. What, uh, what do you ask? <laughs> really? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Out of the seven uh, R's, what are the three most important? Go for Nagel. Uh, I I think this, this is a pen of the of the of the uh, buyer is is comprador. It's a comprador buyer. Purchaser, the buyer. Uh, mm -hmm. For example, we are in El Salvador, so we just we we don't are no we are in the right place because. Mm -hmm. The, the for from Amazon the products in, in USA you have to you have to consider the price and the taxes to to get your product to El Salvador shipping. to ship to ship the product to El Salvador very expensive so yes and some some product but you have to the, the most important the most important thing for me is first the price the price is related to the to the place where where are the the, the product in, in USA or the product is or some sometimes the, the product comes from China mm -hmm. the, 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 the 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 price this the second the second for me is the is a right right time because I, I want some, some, I don't want to, to wait a lot of time to get the product. And the third one? And the, the, the right condition, because I want my product in a optimal condition. Okay. Does anybody differ with uh, Fernando? I agree with him. Okay. You agree but with you, him? But you know what? Uh -huh. I, I wrote, I read, I read, read. that, yeah, I read that uh, employees of Amazon is going to do going. a strike. Are, are going to do a strike? Strike, yeah. In two days, in November. 26 mm -hmm. and this is this that is going to affect the time the right time actually I'm sorry mm -hmm. related to the topic right yeah okay i'm sorry guys i was attacking attacking yeah. <laughs> Rob, so there's a strike in 20 countries that's crazy but did you hear yeah. how, how many people did they hire per season um 50 50,000 50, yeah 50,000 seasonal workers yeah 50,000 seasonal workers it's a lot of people okay Haiti The three R's that I choose. Mm -hmm. um, right price. Uh, right condition and right place. Right place, you mean? Oh. I agree with you with the right condition. I mean, for me, guys, uh, the right condition is like, very important, the right quality, because I had bad experiences. Um, for example, buying um, non-original parts for my car, you know, 1978, if I buy a, a part that is not, oh, is not OEM, you know what is OEM? more generic not that, that's the opposite that's a generic piece a generic part oh my god i'm texting wendy wait a minute oem it's from the factory i mean that's the same piece that they installed at the factory of your product right whether it is a tv or a car 
and a genetic one is a very, very similar piece. It's very close to it. And of course you have an imitation which is made in China, right? With different kinds of plastics, it's not metal, for example. So in that sense, many people have been scammed by Alibaba, for example, right? What's the other website name? AliExpress? eBay, AliExpress. eBay, AliExpress. Do you think you're buying a car, you know, a normal size car, and it's actually a toy? <laughs> it's a toy. <laughs> Things like that. So in that sense, I, I will go first for the product. Second, the price. Yes, but I understand now that if I want good quality, real thing, I have to pay a little bit more, right? Now, the third one is where I have trouble, you know, it's like, I don't know, I already have quality, I already have good price. Oh, time. Time. Time, definitely, it's very important. Right time. Reputation. Reputation. Okay, so yeah, condition is very important as well. Okay, guys, so that was the topic. Señores, no lo puedo creer, es miércoles, yo siento como que si fuera jueves o viernes. My God, esta semana ha estado bien pesada para todo el mundo. Okay, don't worry. Uh, so we're done. I'll see you tomorrow. Let me do the attendance again. Please have some rest. No se vayan a ver Netflix o lo que sea, por favor. Descansen. Dediquen el tiempo a su cerebro para que descanse bien, ok. Relax. Let's go with Ada Susana Cáceres Mendoza. Present. Good night. Good night. Andrés Giovanni Valdivieso Portillo. Present. Good night. Good night. Carolina Ivette Romero Avellino. Present. Get better. Thank you. Irwin Lagos Andrade. Present teacher. Yeah. Fernando Ernesto Cosme Morales. Present. Good night. Good night, Heidi Eugenia Salguero de Rivas. Present. Good night. Good night, Heidi. Irene Susana Cuayer Albanés. Present. Good night. Good night. Tony Vladimir Portillo Chávez. Present. Good night. Good night. José Antonio Cubias Hernández. Present. Good night. Good night, Josué Alberto Salas Benítez. Present. Good night. Good night, Yuri Vladimir Cruz Ventura, Luis Ernesto Romero Argueta. Present. Miguel... Good night. Hey, there you are. Sorry. Good night. Miguel Ángel Paz Landa Verde. Present. René Alfonso Madrid Escalante, Roberto Luis Mañorellana, Sandra Elizabeth Osorto Romero. Present. Good night. Good night. Wendy Patricia Molina Duarte. Present. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night. William Alexander Ramírez Flores. Present. Suleima Ivón Moreno de Hernández. Alexander de Jesús Sánchez Soto. Present. Good night. Good night. And Jocelyn Imelda Rivas Abarca. Present, teacher. Good night. Good night. Bye bye. So. What's up? How are you, Miguel Angel? I feel very tired, teacher, to be honest. Yes. It's mute. Ah, okay. So, sorry. I'm so sorry. It's okay. <laughs> We had a long week too, right? What happened yesterday? Wow, uh, I have had three three very difficult days, teacher. Monday and yesterday, and today was very difficult for me because uh, in, in my department we have a, a audit. Yes, audit. Yeah, we had audits, audits. Uh huh. Yeah, audit. Yeah, and this day was very difficult for this reason because. 
I don't I don't found a documents of years uh, 2018. Yeah. Wait, you couldn't find uh, yeah. some, doc some documents from 2018. Uh -huh. Yeah, but at at that at this time, yeah. I don't work in this company for this reason. It's very difficult to find this document. Wait, uh, back then. Back then, yeah. In aquel entonces, okay. Yeah, yeah. Back then, I didn't used to work. Didn't used to work yeah. at this for this company. For this company, <laughs> for this reason, and for this reason, it's very difficult. Yeah found this document and it's a big problem with our department yeah wait and that document wasn't physical yeah okay yeah it's just that insurance and in insurance you have to keep record of everything right yeah every year but but i'm happy i'm happy too, because today, teacher, I I receive a a good news, yeah, and I I was promoted, yeah, I was promoted. Promoted, really? Yes, to, today, yeah. Wow. In, in, in fifty in fifteen days, I started my new functions. <laughs> Wait, in fifteen days you will start. Yeah, I will new start. New Is it yeah. like a supervisor position or something? In my job, it's a sub, it's a sub manager or manager sub, sub manager, yes, sub manager, yeah. Wow. Yeah, That's I'm awesome. very happy for this. Are you going to be in the office more often? Sorry. Are you going to be in the office more often? Uh, yeah, yeah. Well, in, in, at this time, I am stay in La Hale. And currently, currently. Really? Yes. Wait, are see. you trying to say actualmente or uh, por el momento? Eh, actualmente estoy, estoy currently. Uh -huh. I'm in a hell. I'm in a hell. But in 15 days, I I will stay in. in I office. will move. I will to? move. Yeah. To my new office. <laughs> Where? In a hell? No. In be safe assessor, be safe assessor is the company that hired me. You hired you. Uh huh. And I am stay with in in my work say in planting in La Geo. Yeah, that is come outsourcing. It's have outsourcing. Yeah, like you explain me. You explain me once that. Yeah. They only, they only work with you. Yeah. And but, another and another coworker. Yeah. So he's but, staying. He's staying at La Hill. Yeah, but um, I'm going to change the place. I don't, uh, yes. Is it closer? What are the benefits of moving to these new facilities? Yeah, it's more It's more early to my house. Uh, uh, it's, mm, mm, it's closer to my house. It's closer to my house, yeah. This one. That's good. And I have a new uh, benefit difference. More salary? More salary, yeah. Okay. The best. That's better income. Better, better income. Yeah. Like you're married, right? Sorry? Are you married? Yeah. Yes, I, I'm married and I have two, two, two children. Yeah. What did your uh, wife say? What did your wife say about it? Oh, uh, well, I have, I don't know, eight years. I don't remember. No, what did she say about the new promotion? What did he say? What did ah, yeah, 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 I'm sorry. Yeah. Was she like, wow, more yeah, money. She, she is very happy, happy, yeah. Do you, yeah. are you the only one working in the house? No, my wife, my wife work. My Your work, wife, my wife work. and me work. Both. We both work. Repeat. Yeah. We both work. We both work. We both work. Yeah. 
That's good. Yeah. Okay. We both work. And learning English, will that improve your income too in the company? Do you think later? Yes, teacher, but I don't know in, in this module, teacher, I feel difficult because 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 the top uh, topic, I know I feel difficult for me. Marketing is very difficult. I don't know. We're not talking about market. Well, yeah. Similar. I this know is, the product. This is, marketing. Um, it's not marketing, it's uh, logistics. Logistics, yeah. And this is a topic for you. It's, it's not complicated, but I don't know. I feel different with another modules. <laughs> The different, previous model. different, different than the previous model. The previous model different than the previous models. Yeah. Of course, and we're only speaking in English, so yeah. try it. Yeah. That's that's all I can tell you. Try it. Let's see. What did you understand about today's topic? No, no, no. I I understand the topic, but trying to speak. Yeah, but I don't know. Topic is no. It's not boring, but it's, I don't know, I feel rarely. <laughs> get get interested, get interested in a topic. Um, do you think I love teaching about technical English? Yeah. yeah. No, <laughs> I don't. I mean, I feel interest for these topics, but it's not my thing. I mean, I know about these topics, but I rather I rather teach you how to speak, the grammar, you know, make you speak in the class. But I don't know. I I, I in this module I'm like relax, you know, yeah. let them Crazy. let them go with it. They have to understand the topic. It's up to it's up to you guys because you know. Yeah. We're all we're all adults. I mean, and also it's almost December, you know. So everybody's like, <laughs> yeah. Yes, I feel that is the season. I think so too. Mm -hmm. yeah. What do you do after the class? Well, after the class, I'm going to sleep. You just go to sleep. You don't, I don't know, watch TV or just watch the cell phone for a minute. No. And then no. Not really, because I'm, I'm, well, actually, I feel very tired, teacher. I'm going to sleep. Yeah. I uh, need what to time, I need what time to... do you start work tomorrow? Tomorrow, 8 a.m., 8 but uh, today and Monday, uh, I started very, very early. Yeah. And I left very, very, very late. Tell me about it. Tell me about it. I have to wake up at 4 a.m. Yes. Yes. And I need to rest. Okay. Okay, yeah. Mike. Well, thank you for staying with me yeah. another night. You. Hope you rest some. Enjoy the night. Thank you, teacher. Take care. Bye-bye. Good night.